Hey, what's going on, guys? Bonfire here, and I am in my driveway. Welcome back to another boat build episode. I got 1436 Polar Craft Mod V John boat. This was originally built at one point. I'm going to put down a picture of that, how it was, until everything got rotted. And I felt like redoing the deck at a higher quality. So I'm like, everything's basically done. Just rained last night, so everything's wet because I got all this debris. I, I uh, vacuumed up at one point, but I knew there was going to be more because there's always some. So I'm going to vacuum up that once more with this new rain that came through. Um, but this is basically what the boat looks like. I'm going to basically give you guys a rundown of what I'm going to do, and I'm going to start in the back, actually. This is going to be just a quick video on it. I got rails on both sides. So basically, the back. This is basically the design. This side is going to come out somehow. I can't figure out how to get him out, but he's going to have to come out. He's going to get moved down to here. So basically, this is the drain plug here. Everything's ripped like this. All right, I'm ready now. This whole top right here is going to be aluminum and a wood all the way across this bench. From here to the end of the bench is all going to be a wood platform. This side, without the drain plug, is going to be battery battery they each can fit right here perfectly and then big gas tank right here um so that's basically all this is going to be it's just an aluminum deck gas tank batteries and then these it's going to run the wiring through out through here and about right to this inner part of this part rib um it's going to be up and over in a hatch right here and that is all going to be all my electrical stuff in this area right here. And then this is all going to be open. And I forgot to say, this is going to have one giant latch for... And they, these are going to be separated. There's going to be a nice sheet of plywood going across this to separate both of them with ventilations on the corners and on the back. But that's basically all we're doing up front here is just one of those big old platforms right here. And then we're going up for the middle part. And this is going to be the big deck area. And I forgot to mention over here, all these inner parts are getting foamed and plywood over it for easier walking. And I could put more stuff in there more e more easily. So this is basically the same way as the back. It's going to get aluminum all the way across it. It's going to have a foot pedal right here. I think I'm putting the foot pedal like right here because I last time I had it, I had it like right up here. It was really tough to stand. So I'm thinking about pushing it back towards this guy. And then having my seat either right here or right on here. I really want it on here, but it might be right off the edge of it. My foot pedal will be up here. And then have a hatch in between, if that makes sense. And then I'm going to have a nice smaller hatch right here covering from here to here. That could fit all my um, needed gear. Like the middle one could be all tackle. And then let me come over to the other side. And this hatch right here. Could be even more tackle or a partner's tackle because that side is going to have all batteries in it and all gas tank i'm like yeah they could possibly put their stuff in the gas tank but i don't want them to they don't have to so i'm like it could always be required stuff my tackle their tackle if that makes sense and then on here is going to be the trolling motor i know a lot of people like to have the trolling motor on the right side when they build a jump boat but i previously had it on the left side here and I did not mind ever having it on the left side. But I think I'm going to build it back on the left side. And last time I had a 2x4 that went over. And it just sat too far in the water. I got a Ranger one on here after my previous one messed up. But it's all Ranger set up on this. So it looks beautiful. Works just like a charm. Fantastic. I don't know what that is. I'm not repainting this boat, by the way. The boat's going to stay the color until it gets wrapped one day. Maybe. Um, but it would sit down like to here and it would be too far down for the uh, propeller so I'm wanting it to be up to like here maybe or something because when it was like a foot up or a foot beneath the surface not even a foot maybe like 8 inches beneath the surface it would run fine but if it was like a foot or more beneath the surface it would not go perfectly so I'm thinking of doing a 4x4 four four up this time and going over with the trolling motor and that's basically all my boat is really going to be it's going to be a simple build but it's going to look awesome it's going to get carpeted Get some decals on there. Uh, nothing much with this 1436. I hope it goes well. 
and I hope you guys end up watching this build. I'll build a playlist. I'll upload this video, and then the very next day I'll upload my first build. Because today I'm starting with aluminum. Alright, thanks for watching guys. Stay tuned for some more episodes. See ya.